Okay guys, this is Mr. Shiny Gyarados, welcome you back to Let's Play Fire Emblem 6. In the last part we started this chapter with Zinc. And now we gotta continue on and try and save these villages from the bandits, because we gotta go fast. Gotta go, gotta go fast like Sonic. And I should probably stop making Sonic references, but it's been because I've been playing... Yeah, it's because I've been playing things like Sonic Generations lately. So, yeah, Sonic. Okay, uh... Let's move you there. Let's move Lou over here so this guy will attack him. Yeah, gotta push forward. Lance can go visit this village. And okay. Hey, we got Dorky. And what not? And I'll move forward there. Crap. Oh well. And let's. Yeah, why not just heal Alina for 1 HP? Whatever. Uh, okay. Let's try this. More importantly, hopefully I can get this done fast enough that I can actually record the last two parts of this, most likely, before I have to go to work in an hour less now. Uh, it's gonna be cutting it close, but oh well, we'll see what how far we can get in this part. Oh god damn it. Oh god damn it. Him and that nose for freaking Ratu. Ah. Fire broke, whatever. Heal. Okay, Thani goes to visit that village. Okay, good. Iron sword. Iron sword. Iron sword. Lance visits this village. And at least the villages should be safe, but still got other stuff to worry about that'll be coming up soon. So for now, let's just push everyone up ahead as far as we can. And here's part of the reason why reinforcements. And you know my favorite kind of reinforcements are archers, because they kill me. Yep. Uh, at least, at least I got a plan. It, it'll make sense. I just don't want to spoil the plan. But we got some time. Okay. <laughs> Jeez, this is long. Uh, okay. Uh, this is so long. Yeah, now I remember why I skipped it. All the cutscene stuff when I was just doing my uh, test practice file. Okay, Gonzalez is alive. Perfect. It's very important. Ooh, speed, luck, defense, but everything but strength. Wow. Now that was a good level up. Okay. Alan could use some healing. Okay. Oh my god. god. You know what? We can kill him. This turn. Oh, 
or not. Stupid bandit, you're healing. Let's go fucking leave that guy alone then. Fuck you, I'm leaving. I can kill you later. Okay. First things first, send Duke. Go with the iron blade. Kills that guy. Okay. And now. Level 17. Ooh, we got some luck. Now, have Lilina talk to Gonzalez. That's the only way you can recruit Gonzalez. And he's actually pretty good for an axe wielder in that he actually can max out speed, most likely, and strength and HP, which is kind of ridiculous. The only downside in his stats is that his resistance is god awful. Now, knowing my luck, that means when I actually use him, he'll get nothing but resistance. No, how do you get him so high? He's got like 5% chance because the game does whatever it wants. So yeah, but he's actually he's actually a pretty good axe wielder and I may use him. Not in this chapter because as we'll see his item is awful. Devil axe, don't use it. It can hurt you. Just, just don't. It can hurt you. That's just, that's just bad on all levels. Okay, so heal Alan. Okay. Go move Lance back and move Fur back down here. Go move Roy back here. Gonna move Wendy back. And gonna move Sue back. There's a very good reason why I'm doing this kind of stuff here. That we'll see in a little bit. But anyway, I'll leave Thani there. Yeah, there's more reinforcements, and he's gonna talk again. Lord Sink, the reinforcements from the Jute should be arriving shortly. Damn, where's that damn fourth Chaos Emerald? We're having enough trouble as it is. I need that Chaos Emerald. Damn you, Sonic. How dare you take my Chaos Emerald. I don't need any reinforcements to take all the credit, Sonic. <laughs> God damn it, what's this guy turned into shadow now? What have I done? Just, just walk away and think about what you did. Uh -huh. Slow moving units. It's like Sonic and Sonic 06 going up the loop de loops real slowly. Oh, that's right. I'm gonna move Gonzalez down here. No. Go move Alan. Go move Alan up here. Cuz. Iron Lance. Cuz Iron Lance. Oh. Then move Gonzalez over here. We want Clarine to definitely move here. Heal. So we got Gonzalez there. Boom. Level up for Clarine. Magic luck. Resistance, that's pretty good. And we're gonna just... Just take him out. Just, just take that guy out. Alina, move there. Ellen, move... No, Ellen, move over here. Thani can sort of stay... Oh, I should have healed Thani. Oh, I'm gonna use an elixir. As much as I don't want to, I'm gonna use it. Okay, so move Thani there. Have Lance move over here. Have Roy move up here. Fur over here. And Wendy can kind of stay there for now. Okay, yep, here's the more reinforcements. This time we got Pegasus Knights. These guys aren't so bad, although they can get annoying quickly because of how you have the bandits over there with axes. So you're like, sword person! They'll work very good. And then it's like, no, now we have lances to worry about too. And it's like, duh, the triangle is ruined. Because I don't use enough axe people. Because to be fair, axe people kind of suck. Okay. Okay. Oh god, it's gonna end badly.
Wait, are you- are you serious? He stayed down there. Fucking game. Fucking game. The fucking game. <laughs> he, he stayed down there. He literally stayed down there. What? The hell? This is how it went in the other one practice, so of course they're going to do it this time. Okay, there's freaking... Everyone moved down. God damn it. Ruined my whole entire plan. Oh my god, he, he moved ahead of all his other archers last time. And this time he doesn't move at all. At least I saved the villages so I don't give a crap about the... the bandits up there, but now, yeah. I'm gonna have to fight my way through these- all these assholes just to get to that one guy. And don't forget the Pegasus Knight- oh, there he goes. God damn it. Yeah. And there goes that. So I might as well say something in a second after this turn about what just I can't get now and what I probably won't be able to- the other thing I probably won't be able to get either. <sighs> but anyway, at least he's surviving. Ugh. 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 The game! Ah. Okay. If you let had let all the people named Tates stay alive by the end of the chapter, you would get, well, I think it's the Elysian Whip, whatever can promote Pegasus Knights, you would have gotten it. Now, if you let all of Klein survive, you'd get the thing that can promote archers. I, get, I think it's Orion's Bolt, but I think you can also get an Orion's Bolt somewhere in one of these places or something. Okay. But, okay, so I'm gonna move you there. Now I'm gonna have to start killing these arch these archers. So that'll go, that'll end that chance I had. I can move him slightly forward. Okay, let's just end this. Okay. He's gonna attack Al. This is gonna end badly. Thank God, luck. Let's go with this right, because Alan's supposed to kill that. You asshole. And now Alan's getting his butt kicked by archers, what the fuck? Okay, survive this, please. Okay, thank god. Okay, because I'm not worried about Thani now, because of the plan I had anyway. Just expect them, okay. So let's see. Of course. So we want to fly over here. We want to talk to Tate. And now... What? 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 Whatever, game. Yeah, this is gonna happen. What you have to do to recruit Tate is talk to her with Thani, recruit Klein by talking to him with Clarina Roy, and then talk to her again with Thani. And if you... If you talk to her after recruiting Klein, and not talk, and, and you didn't talk before, she just becomes an NPC unit. You know, one of the green units that just sort of flies around and does whatever. Okay.
Okay. I'm hoping this works. If not, then I'm in trouble. So... Let's hope this works. Yeah, Donnie's okay. Because we moved her in just the right spot. Okay. So we should be able to recruit Klein this turn, which will eliminate half the threats, because any archer... Oh, wow. Thank God for that one HP luck. You are still on my side. And she's gonna throw it at Thani, but we'll recruit Tate in the turn, and then we'll turn all the... All the Pegasus Knights back to our side anyway, so in the end it'll be okay. Oh, that's right, I have the Horse Slayer. <laughs> 40 damage. Jeez, talk about overkill. Aha. Put out the rock here. Talk. Okay. So now all the archers will become our archers. Well, no. They'll be, they'll be whatever. What's the call? They'll be NPCs. But they'll be the greens that are allies. So thank God for that. Okay. Yada 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 Man, I need to think of something to talk about for the next part, since this part's almost over anyway. So now, yeah. Now we have all that. Now quickly, talk. Talk again. So I get Tate, and then the Pegasus Knights will also... Yeah, how how does Thony actually know he just joined us? That doesn't matter. Game, abuse game logic to the max. Okay. Okay. So now we got all those on our side. Oh wait. These archers? Oh crap, those are bandit archers. Yo, it's just my luck. Uh, uh, I think this is where I'm going to leave off, because I don't know exactly what I want to do next. Off the top of my head. So, in the next part, we will continue on and hopefully finish the chapter. And, yeah, hopefully we'll finish the chapter and get it done with. And hopefully luck stays on my side for the rest of this. But, uh, this is Mr. Shiny Gyarados signing out. Have a good day, guys, and goodbye.